Hey residents, it's the one and only Lit Thai and welcome to your daily dosage of Borough News, your number one source for UK news and our only place where spilt tea doesn't leave a stain in your clothes and that's a bar. Now today I got something a little, a little sad for you today, I'm not gonna lie. Because it seems that the late great Black the Ripper's business partner, who goes by the name of Screech, has actually released a statement attempting to set the record straight regarding his friend's death. He actually released a four page statement regarding this issue, which is of course very long, so I'm not gonna you know, read it all out here, but to summarize, he was basically saying that Black the Ripper's assets after his death have essentially kind of disappeared and because he didn't have a will when he died, it made like dividing the assets a lot harder with many people claiming parts of Bank of England company that he feels like they didn't deserve. He also said that some of his some of Black's children's mothers have been spreading lies about him, him as in Screech, but he's been trying to make sure that all of Black's money goes to his kids and feels like he's one of the only people that's actually been trying to make that happen. He then went on to say that he doesn't believe that Black died from a heart attack, which is what was originally told to us because before his death, he was speaking on some real, you know, expose truths about various companies and institutions and he feels like Black was being watched at the time. And it then seems like he was alluding to the fact that Black's mother and stepfather had something to do with his death because allegedly money was being transferred out of Black's own account inconsistently to a certain individual who he has not named at this moment in time. And they apparently launched a production company in December of last year off of Black's name. So. Is, there's a lot of, you know, conspiracy sort of stuff going on here. A lot of stuff to digest, a lot of crazy things to take in. But essentially, he's trying to say that there's a lot more going on behind the scenes regarding Black the Ripper's death than what has originally been told to us. But thanks for listening to Borrow News. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe and turn on your notifications so you don't miss when tea is getting spilt no PG. And that's a bar. But that's been your Borrow News. Take care, residents.